Hi, Casper on the 25th of July. Very quick note on this wine here. Uh, just put a big bit of beef on the barbecue. Well, actually, just taking a big bit of beef off the barbecue. It's resting. So, and just open this, which I thought would go with it perfectly. So, um, can't waste any time. So, let's do this thing. It's 2004 Pago de Costa, the second wine of Costa Destinal. 2004. Ah, you know, one of those vintages that a consumer generally overlooks. Uh, Falls in general, 94, 2004, 2014. Lovely vintages, vintages I really like, I must say, but um, let's have a go at this. Good colour. Quite a deep, sort of mulberry red colour. Still looks very healthy. Oh, it's a lovely nose. Full of the sort of uh, cedary cedary spice and softened ripe plummy red and black plummy plummy fruit it's um smells sort of it's nose frilling it's got lovely breadth and ripeness to it it's it's relaxed into it hint of hint of um licorice perhaps and tomato from the merlot but Just a lo lovely nose. And that palette's nicely resolved, you know, it's 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 relaxed, it's um still got nice freshness at the back, it finishes on this nice scrunch of of acidity. Um and some nice sort of slightly slaty tannins, it's got a got a slightly gravelly character to it. Nice cool thing. It's not, not flashy or, or um, overblown in any way. It's got it's a good line in length. And the finish swathed in these slightly um, clay-like integrated tannins. Nice claret. There we are. Super. 2004 Le Pagode de Cos, uh, second one of Cos d'Estenel, 2004, um, just a really delicious drop from a, a vintage I like, nice thing.